good morning guys welcome back to my channel it is the beginning of a new month happy march guys y'all know spring is in effect and today we are going over the new coupons that have released for the month of March. Some are going to repeat themselves from last month. They're going to carry over and then there'll be a couple of new ones. They normally release on the first of the month. And if you have the app on your iPhone, I am not sure about Android, but I can speak for, I can attest to the iPhone part you will see a notification come across your screen that tells you that there are new coupons that have released. It didn't show on my phone, but it did show on my iPad. So as always, you go to coupons.com and mine is for show all. And I don't know why it's not like full screen. But anyway, I'm just going to scroll through. Or is it because I'm not in? Let's do this. Let's go to coupons. And here we go. That's how we get it to get where we need it. And so the offer of the week is a dollar off Celeste. Celestial Seasonings Tea. Really good tea. Um, I don't know that I want to purchase that. It's getting warm and so I'm not really looking at it. Now this is a unique one here. And guys, I'm going to adjust my computer so that you guys can see. But um, right here. This coupon says, and I don't know if I can get it i did i zoomed in more for you guys this one says a dollar fifty off smithfield on any two avocados from mexico in one baking smithfield bacon item so yeah it has potential like if there's a sale on smithfield bacon then go ahead and there'll probably be a sale on the price of avocados and then you get the 150 off of all three items so that's if that's what you want to do there are a few new ones i have let's go back i have burt b's two good greek low-fat yogurt i don't need those um i because i'm in crisis with my skin i may start using eucerin so I'm going to add that. I definitely need to stock up on household and um, health and beauty stuff. So you see me doing um, scrubbing bubbles, Windex, liquid plumber. Revlon is makeup. So I love Revlon just a little bit. Just a little bit. And scrubbing bubbles business. I don't use shout. I can't stand shout. I like um, spray and wash. And there's a 50 cents off two pledge, Windex, or scrubbing bubbles. I always go ahead and click that. Because normally when I see that coupon, I know that in some store, they're going to have a sale on all of those SC Johnson products and I want to take advantage of it so I want to print all of the coupons that may apply and I do need to keep some Drano because Jalen and his tissue habit he clogs up my toilet all the time so yeah I need to keep that Michael uses um I said I was going to get the post cereal for the kids to try but Michael uses Claritin and He's away at school, and I pretty much can guarantee that he's not been taking it. So he'll be home sick shortly. So I either get the, I don't get him the liquid gels. I get him the pills. And so there should be a Claritin sale or a um, allergy med sale coming up soon because that is very, um, this is the season for it, pretty much. 
And I don't worry about Flonase because I could always call his PCP and get him some Flonase. I do use Acne Free for Justin. And I'm considering grabbing some different um, for him as well. Because his skin has been acting wonky too. Y'all, it's a skin thing in this family. Sargento, y'all know I love that cheese. I live by it. I... Let's see. The kids wanted sausage biscuits, so I do need to click the Jimmy Dean. And I don't use blue cheese that much, so I wouldn't, or any of those um, Treasure Cave products. So, and if you look up here, I have six, uh, 17 coupons that will print, three per page, so I am at... I'm working on the um, sixth page. I heard Cetaphil is good, and I've been wanting to try it, so maybe we'll go with that too. I don't buy pre-made mashed potatoes. Neosporin and Band-Aids, it is the season to have those because the kids will go outside and play, and then they'll end up hurt, and I need some. I have depleted my supply. Um, all the way around and y'all know I gotta have my fruit for my frozen fruit smoothies and it seems that that's all that's available I don't need like any of this other stuff so 21 coupons will be 7 pages I have 7 pages worth of coupons that will print again guys you will hear my prints go off and uh, while that's happening, I am going to, I need for it to actually start printing because I still, once I go and print these seven pages, I can go back, select the same coupons and print this second copy. And then I'll work on my iPhone. I'll show you guys how I do it using my iPhone. So, like I said, March is going to be the new month for everything, new coupons and such to come out. I need to make sure that my, um, I don't know what's going on, y'all. My coupons keep printing so small. Remember, I, this happened in February. My coupons printed so small. I'm not even going to trip. But as you can see, when I say I calculate things properly, you see it says seven sheets of paper. That's exactly how much I'm going to use. So let's go back to that. And I'm going to hit my print. Did I? I didn't hit my print button. Why does it say my print is offline? My print is not offline. That's lame for them saying that. My printer is not offline. Uh, um, I'm trying to wait for it to start, actually. I told you guys, I think that my printer has a delay. I don't know if I've updated it or if there's an update for it. There's something going on. But it must be getting ready to print. The little icon disappeared off of my computer. I don't know, guys. Don't let me lie. But I know my printer is not offline. Okay. Let me go back in. And I don't know if it's going to do it here. I think it will. And watch it prints later on. I don't know what it is about my printer. Uh, I'm just scrolling down to the bottom of the page because that's where the coupons I selected would be. See? Here they are. 
Now I just go across and I select them and they're all in the same order that I selected them. And I just go across and add them back to the printer cube. And you'll see them there. I go fast, guys, when it comes to this because I've been doing it for so long. It doesn't take me that long. I'm only I'm actually marginally slower because of you guys. And now do you see at the bottom where it says limit reached, limit reached? That means that only one print is available per device for these two. And I'm going to hit. That's why it's grayed out. I can't print it a second time. I'm waiting for my coupons again. And I don't know why my printer hasn't printed. I, I bet it'll print later on. Because it keeps saying that it's offline and it's not. The printer is on. Um, I think that's what's wrong. I don't know. Y'all, don't let me see the lies. And my coupons didn't print at all. But it says that they did, which means they're in my printer queue. And I'm going to have to go in it. But I'm going to step away from this. And I am going to turn my attention to... See? There they go. They're all about to print now. I told y'all it's a delay. But I'm going to change the view. We're going to look down, 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 down. And a little bit closer. And we're well, not that close, guys. Hold on. Alright. iPhone. Go here. Go here. This is my coupons.com app. I am now in the app. Okay. Same procedure. I select cereal. Now, I won't select all of them because I don't think I need four prints of. Well, if I'm stocking up, truth be told, I will utilize four because that gives me a sufficient stash to last a couple of months. Definitely want to hit my Jimmy Deans. Can you guys see? Maybe I did that a little. I'm going to go under. All right, I didn't do the fruit. I still didn't do it. I don't want any of that stuff. Oh, look what's on the mobile app, which is funny. Some fresh chicken. Definitely want that. I'm good on that. Mine doesn't have to be organic. Um, you serin, that one, that one. The Acne Free Kit, the Different Gel, the Cetaphil. It seems like all my um, coupons are in a row on this app right here. And that's that. And I'm scrolling. I don't see anything I want. My son's Claritin. That one. Oh, Tootie needs Flintstones. I don't do one a day. These are the chewables. I don't like those. But this is off anyone. See, it shows the chewables. But if you read the coupon, it says save $1 one a day on any one one a day multivitamin. So I can use it on the ones that are not chewable. So I definitely want to grab that. Because I think my supply has run out. And then... Hold on, guys, because I have this case on it. I messed it up. But anyway, I'm going to go back. See at the bottom, it says clip coupons. 
I don't want to clip the dog food. I want to hit the clip coupons. Takes me to this page that says cart. At the bottom, you see it says print. I hit print. My printer comes up over here. See how it has the green light? That means that it's connected. I can hit this. Now, when you are printing from your iPhone, you cannot let it get off of this screen. At the bottom, it says printing, and there is a loading bar that's going to go across your screen. If your screen, your backlight cuts off, it is going to stop printing and you will lose your print so you have to make sure that you stay on this page so what i do is i just hold it because i don't remember if i set my um my backlight to cut off in three minutes or if i left it on and i think it's set to cut off in three minutes i think i changed it back i should have changed my setting again but i didn't so i just keep tapping the screen until it completely prints And once it shows me that it has loaded and printed everything, then I'm good. I get off of here. So I'm going to let that happen, guys, and I'll be right back with you. So we can talk some more about the beginning of the month and things that happen during the beginning of the month. All right, guys. So I am back, and I'm going to tell you guys about the beginning of the month. So during the beginning of the month, my printer is still going, guys. Um... At the beginning of the month, we normally have a PNG insert if it didn't come out last week, which it did. It came out the last paper, which was on the 24th. That is the day we got the PNG inserts for March. Normally, on a good day, you will get the PNG the first Sunday of the month and I'm holding because I can't quite find out right now what I don't know what I did with my laminated insert schedule so I don't know how many inserts are coming but because this is March and it's frozen food month I can pretty much guarantee that you guys want to get the get the inserts every um every Sunday in this month because there will be good frozen food deals. Now, I look washed out, guys, and it's because this lighting sucks. But, yo. Anywho, so, you want to get your paper. Now, the rule of thumb for the papers, it varies. I think I talked about it before. The rule of thumb is you get one paper per person in your house. So if you have a household of five, that's five papers. It's just you, one. But it will take you longer to stock if you only get one paper. It's going to take you longer to build your supply. And you will also have to look for alternate resources if you need more than one of a coupon that comes in your Sunday paper and you only got one so that's why I don't recommend one I don't even care if you are a family of one I think that two is sufficient you would have one and then you would have a backup so that's a good plan um so yeah make sure you're doing that make sure that because it is the beginning of the month that you are checking your rebate apps because check out 51 reset on Wednesday and I bought a probably set yesterday, which is February 28th, was, I should say, February 28th. So those two, I know for sure, have probably already reset. Now, Saving Star won't reset until Sunday, and they reset every Sunday anyway, unless it's one of those one or more deals. Those are good for a month to two months at a time so those will stay the same and those are usually at the very top of your app if you're using the app and then the newer coupons will follow on the bottom or rebates should I say will follow on the bottom and so oh guys 
one thing I want to tell you. When you are printing your coupons, you are going to go through a large amount of ink. But save your ink cartridges and turn them into Office Max, Office Depot, or Staples and get their 2%, I think it's 2% back for each cartridge up to 10 cartridges at a time and up to 10 in a month it's either 10 or 20 but they have an ink uh return a cartridge return program recycling program so you may want to check into that and what i do is i check the levels of my ink which is time for me to do so because i've not purchased ink in four months four or five months and that's because I only print one time and I haven't been heavily couponing so I haven't been printing normally I print everything like all the time and my printer would be going non-stop but because I haven't been heavily couponing I'm not um there with it so my ink has lasted longer normally I go through um a regular size cartridge for hp i go through that in about two months if it's an extra large i may be able to get three months out of it and depending on how many prints like i haven't printed my um uh i have not printed my how long guys hold on Hold on, guys. I'm getting a call. Okay, guys. Okay, I'm back now. So, I was able to pull up and find out how many inserts are coming out this Sunday. On March 3rd, there will be four inserts. You're going to get two Retail Me Not inserts and two Smart Source inserts. So, this is a heavy coupon week. Whenever you have more than just your standard retail me not and smart source only two of them it's a heavy coupon week and it's a week where you should definitely go out and grab your papers definitely with no questions asked so i will be grabbing my papers um definitely on the third and on the 10th, you'll only have two. On the 17th, it'll be two. On the 24th of March, it'll be one. And then on the 31st, you will have three. So that is another week that you definitely need to go out and get your paper because you have Retail Me Not, Smart Source, and PNG. Anytime the PNG insert comes out, you definitely want to get it. And especially because this month is spring cleaning month and we're starting to come up on um different holidays like easter and all of that so you definitely want to grab papers on the 31st yes so go out and definitely get it on sunday the third and go ahead and get on the 31st i will come back every month on the first of the month and i will do these videos so that you guys are staying aware of what coupons and i'm staying on top of you and if you guys have a coupon organization system normally i'll tell you guys to clear it out on the last day of the previous month so that when the new month comes in you have a complete fresh start because you can get so lost and um overwhelmed with your coupons in your organization system if you're not constantly staying on top of it so that is my goal to continue to tell you guys at the end of the month or the very early part of the following month go ahead on and let's get this system cleaned out because you have coupons who have expired you know and they're probably still lingering in your in your coupon organization system and you do need to follow up with that and be proactive when it comes to that because it's easily to get it's easy to get lost in the um coupon insert situation and i'm going to tell you why or how rather because I didn't clip any none of my coupons were clipped 
for the month of February. I didn't clip any in January either. I just have not been in the mood to clip them. And I need to hold myself accountable as well. So I'm going to show you why. Because this is January, February, January and February inserts right here. I'm not going to throw them away until I go through and see what's expired. So when I have downtime, free time, um, I typically will do that. Go ahead and dump it. I'll chuck my coupon organization system, which guys, I told you guys, I am going to do a binder, um, show you guys what my new system is going to be since I'm starting fresh and I'm going to walk you guys through it. So I am going to order the supplies that I need so that I can film the video. I was supposed to have done it. So silly me, I placed a big order, um, to do an unboxing and I didn't get that. That wasn't in it. And I don't know if I'm going to go. I think I may go in the store and just actually purchase all of the stuff so that I have it with me. And you guys don't have to wait for me to have a delivery. And I can just go ahead and film it. Um, I may do that live. It's high time that I go live. And do a video and interact with whoever wants to be a part of that. So I may do that live. And it won't be. It won't be March. And the reason being is because a large group of my folks who coupon are on Facebook. And I've not released my YouTube to my Facebook group because I am off of Facebook for um, a sus uh, substantial amount of time because I needed to work on this YouTube platform and start getting this going because my Instagram's already, you know, active and my Facebook is very active because I have a coupon group and a coupon page in on Facebook. So I'll start linking videos there and then I'm going to actually offer a class, a webinar or a class. I don't know yet. Y'all don't don't but I'm going to go over to Patreon too. So you guys will be able to who just want to see couponing, you guys will be able to just strictly see that over on Patreon. Everybody else who wants to do all my other stuff that I do on YouTube, they can enjoy that there. So it's not so cluttered. Everybody has a place to be. So you guys look forward to that. I will post it. I will also have an in-person class for my folks who are in Birmingham. And what I will then do is record those classes and do that. So you guys, I also have a challenge coming up for as, as soon as I can get to the bank and withdraw the money um, because I am going to use cash. So as soon as I can withdraw the money, I'm going to come, I'm going to count it in front of you guys and I'm going to take you with me on my shopping trip, plan my shopping trip and show you guys how much I spend and then we'll just keep and then at the end of the challenge I will show you what I have what all I've gotten for that price so you guys stay tuned for all of that it's nothing but good stuff it's a lot of content it's going to be heavy and it's going to be in bits and pieces and you guys are going to have to kind of just bear with me because I'm trying to get a flow for my couponing because on YouTube you can't do but so much videoing because if I go into depth about coupon on YouTube, a class could a little class could last hours, literally, because it's so much content and information, and I choose not to overfeed you all of that information. And as things are changing, I need to keep you guys aware. Plus, I also need to get myself back in the loop so that I can really, really show you guys. Because I've been laid back and I I kind of slacked off on couponing, but yeah. So, as always, guys, get your March stuff together, and we're going to go through this. You know, on 
Monday, I will be going over couponing at Dollar Tree, Family Dollar, Dollar General. So stay tuned, guys. And thank you for watching. See you in the next video.